Welcome to the BioClear step-by-step -step guide for the injection molded class two. Finish the class two preparation and remove the pre-wedge. Remove loose enamel rods and hard deposits like calculus with the Comet diamond strip. Blast both the inside and the outside of the tooth using the aluminum trihydroxide in the BioClear blaster. Optimize the neighboring contact with the disc. We like to use the 3M Softlex XT coarse disc in the inverted position. Measure the cavity depth guide using the Evolve matrix height indicator and Go No Go probe. You can go ahead and measure inside of the cavity prep and then go ahead and measure outside of the cavity preparation to assess where the gingival attachment is. The BioClear Evolve matrix is rugged and will withstand heavy seating pressure. Trap the tab of the matrix against the neighboring marginal ridge during insertion to keep the matrix fully seated and stable. Push as hard as you can for five seconds to fully seat the matrix. The tab should be centered as shown. Continue to push on the matrix while you insert the diamond wedge. Push the wedge as far as you can with the back of the cotton pliers once it's been inserted. Place the twin ring universal. The twin ring has four hands that will straddle the wedge. Once the twin ring is placed, gently rock the twin ring apically like a rubber dam clamp to assure full seating and full power. Place the phosphoric acid etchant. Make sure to inject acid etch all the way to the edge of the matrix, which is the infinity edge area. Then etch for 20 seconds, rinse and dry. Place and massage the 3M Scotchbond Universal Plus adhesive into the dentin tubule areas. You will do this for 20 seconds. Air thin the adhesive. Place two beads of room temperature 3M Filtech Bulk Fill Flowable Restorative, two millimeters in diameter, inside, over, and outside the corners of the matrix near the cusp tips. The push-pull instrument is placed inside of the cavity preparation with pressure mid-coronal apical to approximate the matrix for a broad, tight contact. The assistant will light cure for one second on each spot weld area while the doctor holds the push-pull instrument. Cure again after removing the push-pull instrument. Second application of adhesive. The cavity area and infinity edge areas are wetted using 3M Scotchbond Universal Plus adhesive as a surfactant, allowing good flow of composite. Air thin the adhesive, then inject heated flowable. Slowly inject the warm 3M Filtech Bulk Fill Flowable Restorative at 90 degrees to the matrix tooth interface, which will displace the uncured adhesive. Inject heated Filtech 1 bulk fill paste composite. The heavier paste composite will displace most of the warm flowable composite, leaving a strong, seamless restoration. Quickly shape the composite. A central groove should be placed with the composite massage toward the cusp tips. Do not over manipulate or marginate the composite. Light cure the composite for 10 seconds on the occlusal surface. This is the first step in three-point curing. Remove the twin ring and then light cure from the buckle and the lingual. Make sure to cure from the buckle and the lingual for 10 seconds each. Remove the diamond wedge, then release the matrix from the tooth with an explorer. Spin the matrix out with the hemostat. Initial cutback. A football-shaped diamond burr or carbide is used to cut back gross excess and begin to create simple fossa near the contact area. Leave slight excess, marginating later. The Q-finisher carbide is used to create simple anatomy and to begin to marginate the occlusal surface. Sculpt the restoration with the disc. A 3M Softlex XT coarse disc is used to round the marginal ridge. Keep the disc out of the deep interproximal areas in order to maintain the smooth mylar finish. Placing the disc in the inverted position is often very helpful for sculpting. Slide the safe area of the Softlex strip through the contact, then strip the gingival with coarse and fine grits. The Magic Mix Pre Polish. 
Bioclear Magic Mix is applied in a disposable cup for further margination and pre-polishing. Actively move the cup and the mix to all areas, replenishing Magic Mix to the cup every three seconds. Rockstar Polish. The Bioclear RSP polisher is used with light pressure in the dry phase and then heavy pressure in the wet phase. Your system will blow a gentle air stream during the dry phase and constant full air water during the wet phase as the doctor applies heavy pressure to the cup. Final outcome, the Bioclear Class 2 is a welcomed update of the traditional Class 2. It is both aesthetically and radiographically beautiful. It is smooth to the patient's tongue and comfortable in function.